and Millie. You and that pillow. Wherever Millie goes, that pillow goes. And you go. It's 14 degrees, guys. Yeah, it's 14. No, it's not in you're not in Tampa Bay. You tell so many lies. Oh. Let's see what we got over here. Well, they don't eat out of this one like they do the other ones. All right, let me put you guys down so I can fill this. All right. And all them little goomers are in them bushes in there. Just waiting for me to walk away so they can get them a drink. I'll tell you. All right, let's go in the back. I already filled those, but I'll ah, just give that to the chickens. Lily, you want some scratch? You guys want some scratch? Okay. Oh, it is a balmy 14 degrees right now. Yeah. One more day of this stuff. Why ain't you over there with uh, Melly? Because I'm out. All right. My most popular bird feeder is in the back there. And this one they drain in about a day. You can see them all flirting around out there. There's also one behind the chicken coop. Whew. Need to get a few more. This ground gets solid, they don't eat. Yes, I know birds will survive. I like to feed them. And this one uh, gets drained very quickly. So what I like to do, if I got any left like that, we'll just spread it out. Make it a little easier for them. Yeah, a bunch of cardinals this year. Well, I got cardinals year-round here, but... Yeah. Let's step back here a little bit and watch them. Where'd you go, Tilly? All right, I'm going to tell you guys a story while we watch the birds. Oh, cows are eating out there. All right. I have the entire story on Millie. Just to show you that I'm here, I'm here. Uh, Tilly, dogs don't eat bird seed. Tilly, apparently she does. Uh, who, who, who knew? So anyway, Tilly, or Millie, the guy that found, no, first let me tell you how uh, Millie was found. I put collars on my dogs with my phone number on it. And, <laughs> Millie being the way she is it strays away from people it probably took him a while you get you know the, but I don't think she was there longer than a week and where she ended up was where she was born yep he's a hunter and that was a dog he had he said he has papers on her those mean nothing to me I said I don't care about papers she's just a dog uh, they have dog shows and stuff for these hunting dogs down here. I could care less about that. Um, so anyway, uh, he gives the dog, not this next trailer, but there's a, like a shed the house down the road, uh, on the other side of this one between me and Jeff. So he gave, he gave the dog to that guy. That guy just sold his place and moved and left her. Didn't, you know, just left her. So that's how she ended up at Jeff's a couple of years ago. And then, you know, about a year later, she showed up here. Dumped a load of puppies on me. And the rest is history. So she went from the original place to that guy over in there. And... Well, she's back here now. She's been good. She hasn't run off. She doesn't leave. She's happy to be with Tilly. And they're doing good. And she better do good. Because 
I ain't building a fence, guys. I don't care. You guys can comment that all you want. I'm not building another fence. I never asked for Tilly. I never asked for Millie. But I'm taking care of them. But they are very, very smart when it comes to the road. Most of these dogs around here are. It's usually the puppies that get hit. Uh, you know, that's, that's a 55 mile an hour road, but it isn't that busy. And they actually hear me long before I get here because they recognize the sound of your vehicle. And they're waiting. And we'll go visit with Miss Melly. And Millie has discovered the heated doghouse. Now they're both crammed in there at night, which is what I want. Ooh, it's probably ice cold already. My coffee over here. Let's get it. Mm. All right. Let this car pass. What are you doing, Melly Moo? I need another drink of that. Ah. But uh, apparently I did a good job with getting her used to people and trusting people. Because she's not scared anymore. Why do you got to drag that pillow out everywhere you go? Yeah, I put fresh straw out for you. And that's why you're out here, huh? Do you know how happy Tilly is that you're back? She was lonely. She was lonely. What did you tell her? No. Listen, boy. The lies you tell, you're going to pay for that one day. Oh, where's Tilly? There's Tilly. But guys, without giving my number away, this is what I put on all on these two. Okay, they all have them, uh, but I don't keep them on them guys. They're in a yard. I don't keep one on Rooster, uh, but she has one as well. We go to the vet. That goes on. I'll tell you, or Millie, and that brass tag on the side there is the reason that Millie's back here now. Because a guy called my number. What are we barking at? But you, you're home now. Two and a half months you were gone. Two and a half months. I'll tell you. Yeah, and that's the story of Melly. You don't put your nose. Come on, girl. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I scared you, didn't I? Get it. Get it. Oh. Oh. Give me that pillow. Here, Melly. Oh. Isn't that goofy? That better not have all that feathers or stuff in it. That would be a mess. They don't tear stuff up, but they like to flop it around. Let's go. Let's go see your bone collection, Melly. No, you don't go after that stray dog. Come on, Melly. Let's go see your bone collection. Come on. I kept her bone collection. I just couldn't get rid of it. Come on, Melly. You're like, who has a bone collection? Melly. Check my light. Check my light. Oh, yeah. She's on. Come on. Come on. They don't listen the best. I don't know where the bone collection is. I threw it over here, but it's gone. <laughs> that must be because Melly's home. What the heck? They might have picked it up. Look at all that garbage over there. Huh. Oh well. She'll get more, trust me. Oh. I don't want that laying around. I've been picking up glass for 10 years here. And it just keeps surfacing. And the trailer's gone, if you guys haven't noticed. 
screw come and got that. I think I filmed that. I don't remember. Aren't you guys cold? You're not cold? Well, I am. I'm going to go in, okay? I'm going to go in. That's a piece of glass. You could have stepped on that. You're not getting it. If I have something, they want it. Doesn't matter what it is. They want it. Alright. Get back, you guns. Oh my god, it's hot in here. Woo! Let's turn your electric heater off. You don't need that. I went to town yesterday and got some more propane, just in case. You can't have too much propane, can you, boy? Lily. It's like a sauna in here. Well, I got some bad news. Your new bucket. Actually, it's not your new bucket. It's Millie and Tilly's new bucket. It hasn't arrived. Post office don't know where it's at. Because post office is bringing all Amazon orders now. And they don't know where it is. Because you were going to get their old bucket. Because you don't need heated water. You got that old well water stain bowl there. It's stained, but it's clean. I wash it out every day. So, yeah, now anything I order from Amazon comes with the post office. They usually do a good job, but they've lost several things, or it's, it takes a week or two to get here. I don't like that, because I needed that bowl. I also ordered a filter for the propane for this, and it's delayed. But I'm giving them a break because of the weather. Uh, some of these things are coming from the east where they've had bad weather. So I'm cool with it. I mean, it's, it's not an emer you know an emergency. All right, guys, we're gonna end the video. Waldo. All of a sudden now he's got a fetish where he's chewing up this cardboard that I laid down here. And the reason this cardboard's down here is because this floor is awful. It's uh, got rocks in the concrete and it's rough. So I put this down so they didn't have that hurting their paws. And, but he's eating it up now. I don't know why you're doing I never know what you're doing in some of the things. See, he's chewing into it. And Lily always behaves. I never have no trouble with Lily. It's always you or Tilly. You or Tilly. Or Rooster. Yeah, uh, Rooster wants in and out, in and out, in and out. She doesn't know what to do. At least you know I don't have to let you out. You got your own doggy door. Boy, is it warm in here. Woo! That plastic I put up has helped tremendously. It'll probably, I'll take it down in the uh, winter or summer so the warm air can rise up. All right, guys, I'm going to go in now. It's cold, but it's not cold in here. Willie, let me fix your blanket. You're not in your right bed. That's Waldo's bed. Go over to your bed. There you go. They, they have their assigned beds. She gets mad when Waldo gets in her bed. Get in your bed. That boy ain't right. They like when I come in to visit them. Which is several, many, many times a day, huh? Alright guys, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you want. If you don't, I don't care. Happy trails. I got chicken strips. Dude. <laughs> That's where they like to sit. What well, do you want it? You got a heated doghouse, so you don't have to sit out in the sun. Good girl. Tilly. Oh, now these two are out. Now ah, they see, and I got to get them one too. Dogs are like kids. You can't give a treat to one kid. Because all the rest of them's gonna want it. Did you want a chicken strip? You're gonna make me walk over there, really? They they like sitting by these trees when the sun comes up, even though it's cold. But it doesn't. I'm out here with no coat. It doesn't feel bad, especially if you're in the sun. So now we know the whole history of Millie, and he did tell me that she is five five years old uh, he gave her away to that guy I think when she was two which makes sense so now you guys know the rest of the story 
Oh my god, we're gonna have to shut the whole town down. There's still snow. <sighs> and of course, you cannot give the outside dogs a treat without this one knowing about it. Rooster, was that good? You got a bacon treat. They all got chicken strips because you had a chicken strip earlier. And then we'll have burgers later. Yeah. Why are you licking? You're, you're, you're licking your bed. Does it have bacon strips? <laughs> oh, they're so goofy. Rooster, was that good?